Hey everyone, let's talk chemistry. We are a group Louisons, and today we'll be talking about one of the best chemists to ever live. His name was Joseph Louis Gay Luzac. A little biography about him was that he was born and raised in Saint Leonard de Noblon, and soon after he moved to Paris, where most of his major discoveries came, such as iodine becoming an individual element, and also such as he also co-discovered the boron atom, and he also made huge experiments such as the hot air balloon, where gas stays constant, whichever level it is, throughout his journey upon the air balloon. Joseph Louis Gay-Lussac is mainly known for two gas laws. The first of these gas laws states that pressure is directly proportional to temperature. This means how in a gas, if the temperature rises, then the pressure of that gas also rises. Next, we're going to do an experiment that shows the gas law. The things that you will need for this experiment is a can, any type of aluminum can, such as a Pepsi can or a Coke can, a Bunsen burner, water, and a large container with cold water. As a safety precaution, you will also need a lab apron and also safety goggles, and especially tongs. Okay, ready? Wait, three, two. Hmm. Oh, that was proper. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was proper. That was proper. That was proper. The flame causes the water in the can to become water vapor. This causes the pressure inside of the can to become more and more. When you put it into the cold water quickly, this causes the water vapor to condense, thus making the pressure inside of the can much less than the, water, than the pressure of the water outside of the can. This causes the can to crush. As you can see from these gas laws, Gay Luzac has contributed amazingly much to the basis and to the foundation of chemistry. In 1824, he also coined barrettes and pipettes, which are two instruments that are used in chemistry, and right now they're being used all over the world in those terms. That is not all that he did, however. He also did a lot of research and committed a lot of his time in terms of alcohol and water, the measurements of them, which soon led to degrees gay Luzac. This measurement is, a con is to measure the concentration of alcohol in beverages used all over the world today. That is what Gay Luzak is all about. That's it, right? Gay Luzak. Okay, wait. Inside of the. Decreases.